Hey guys, just a quick question from a recent live stream study session. Hope this helps you on your journey. Uh, which command is used to create the following configuration? Huh, this is a type one. Show IP. So we look at EIGRP, this configuration. Which command is used? All right, all right, all right. It looks like uh, the answers are in. The answer is actually A. We'll check that and get that okay. Now, now this is this is really tricky. If you struggled with them, uh, is there a wooden spoon fries? Of course there's a wooden spoon fries. If you struggled with this one, I totally don't blame you because this is one of the most confusing commands in all of the Cisco iOS. It's the network command. So, so here's the idea. So I'm gonna draw a network diagram that might be what uh, what lines up to this. So let's just say this is uh, our router, RTR, right? This is our router. Um, so we have a network over here. Let's just make it 192.168.1.81 slash 28, which would be a 255.255.255. What would that be? 2240, right? 240. Um, over here, we have a network. Uh, let's just say 192.168.1.120. Nine, you know, slash twenty. So this this is the IP address assigned to the router. So so uh, slash twenty eight, right? So this command, if I wanted to run EIGRP on both networks, I would type this in because this command does not directly control what EIGRP advertises. The network command actually does two things. So check this out. One, the network when you type in network one and two, it says it, it, so it will identify interfaces to send hello messages. Identify interfaces to send hello. So what this says is any interface starting with 192.168.1 will start sending hello messages. Second is it will identify interfaces to advertise. Identify interfaces to advertise using the EIGRP process. So, so this, by default, EIGRP is a class full routing protocol. So when I type this in right here, when I, you know, network one and two, it's going to say, okay, I'm going to take the default class C subnet mask, right? Which is, is kind of what they show in, in as uh, the second answer B. It's, it, it does that by default. So it says, okay, I'm just gonna assume any interface starting with 192.168.1 and it says, oh, I see one, I see two. I'll start sending hello messages out here. Hello, hello, trying to form neighbor relationships. And I will advertise these two networks to other routers. So when router, let's just say five over here, uh, forms a neighbor, this guy will be like, hey, router five, did you know I've got the 192.168.1.128 network? Let me tell you about it, right? And so, so that's that's what yeah, that's that's what this network command does. It's one of the most confusing things, um, confusing things when you get into routing protocol. <laughs> Jedi, he's like, I've got the lock on the wooden spoon. Let's see. I'm I, I, so I'm curious. I'm honestly curious who's going to win this competition. Well, that's it. Stay tuned for more study session questions.